Make no mistake, this is no dress rehearsal. It is the real thing. We are ready for action in the group stage. It's live next on EA TV. Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the group stage for these two nations here at the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's Italy versus Argentina. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. And the Italy starting 11. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. The Argentina first team. Well, they're playing in a 4-5-1 formation, which is set up to counter-attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. And they kick off here. Might be able to produce from this position. And well, he stopped them in their tracks. Valentina Chernoya. Bonansea. Oh, that's an interesting pass. And still trying to get the shot off. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Can someone get on the end of this? Now well, it still could be dangerous. Can they take the lead here? Well, getting in the way, superb save. Trying to deliver it accurately. And still danger here. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. It was so close to getting that early goal there, but it was a wonderful save by the keeper, you have to say. Well, they can't exhale just yet. Here they come again. This might be ideal for the counter. Chance to finish. 
Well, it was so easy on the eye, that counter-attack, but no reward for them. Yeah, it was all good until the final effort. It just shows how devastating they can be on the break, though. Girelli are getting the ball forward but really sticking to their task defensively has eyes for goal and still an opportunity oh it comes to nothing in the end really should have made more of that well the keeper's made a good save but you just sense a goal is coming soon Foul play, says the referee. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. So now a corner. Playing it in. Cleared away. Lost possession. Girelli. Caruso. Estefania Banini. Moving into the advanced position. And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Well, here we can see it again. It's a lovely ball in behind, perfectly timed, and then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So underway again here, one nil the score. Cristiana Girelli. It's a neat move. She's made a really important challenge. Now can they counter clinically? Nunez this is looking threatening no possibilities inside the box just looking for the right moment for that final pass intercepting it intelligently and coolly done despite the mounting pressure And space to attack. It's a weighted pass. A smart stop here. Who can they pick out? Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively.
Firing it in. Just made sure nothing came of that. Could play it in. Rodriguez. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. A foul, but advantage played. It needs an accurate cross. Oh, great defending. Well, she keeps moving. It might be on for them. Great opportunity. Oh, a tremendous block. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw-in. And the referee will go back now to the earlier incident. Yellow card it is. Caruso. Now with Girelli. Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. A good and fair challenge. 30 minutes to go then. Well, the fans are going mad here. They think that was a penalty. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Goal. So 2-0 now. Argentina. Valentina Chernoya, Ariana Caruso. Takes the shot. Well, tremendous block. And the substitution will occur now. Corner kick played in. Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Now, will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? Well, Argentina are enjoying most of the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Girelli. Giuliano Bartoli can they convert and there it is still life left in this game and they have the momentum now well here's the replay and just look at that power that's almost unstoppable that's a great strike Back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here.
Nunez. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Could be a chance to break here. Defenders need to cover. Oh, she's in a really promising position. Late drama here. Level once more. Incredible scenes. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Good pass. They're on the scent of a winner late in this game. Florencia Bonsegundo. Cross blocked. Winning the ball back. What can she do from here? Well, they couldn't do anything with that particular cross. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Will they profit from this situation? Well, it peters out, but they still might be able to do something. Can she connect with a teammate? Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. Oh, it's astonishing. One of the greatest comebacks you're ever likely to see. And now the question is, can they see this out? Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. And there goes the final whistle. It's a victory for Italy. Stuarts, what have you made of their performance? Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end.